Good morning, guys. As you guys can see, it snowed last night. So I think I'm just gonna stay indoors today. Um, today is Tuesday. Um, the apartment's a little messy, so I'm gonna clean that and then clean my room again. I think I might just get ready to stay indoors because honestly, I have no idea what I have planned. I just kind of do things along the way. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go clean everything and then I'll get ready. But in this vlog, I think I'm gonna be doing a makeup tutorial. I've been asked on how I do my makeup a lot, so I think I'll film like a small, simple one, um, especially with my wing liner, so I, I guess I'll add that in today. Yeah, so I'm gonna go clean a little bit and I'll be right back. finished cleaning so I'm at my desk right now um, so I'm gonna be doing my makeup right now I don't really have anything planned I cleaned I'm probably gonna make myself some coffee after this but I'm gonna do my makeup and I'm gonna film it I'm gonna be explaining what I use how like what process I do it in even though it's like completely wrong I'll try explaining it more in depth of what I do when I do my makeup so I'm gonna go grab my stuff and I'll be right back. So I got my mirror, put my hair back. So I know I said I'm not gonna be going out today unless I do, I really don't know. Some of my plans are just kind of a spur in the moment thing. I am still gonna be doing a full face of makeup. So um, I'm gonna start off by just moisturizing my face. So I've been using this as some moisturizer and it's actually been working really well. Like I like the way it leaves my skin, so. I had already washed my face earlier, so I'm gonna just put So I'm gonna be um, using the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer. Can I just say though, like, I finished Bridgerton, right? Like, last week. And I'm like, I just like, kinda was like, all right, whatever, like, I finished it, it is what it is. And then I was like, okay, so normally I just end up like rewatching shows I've already watched. But for some reason, last night I couldn't sleep. And I was just kind of scrolling through, um, going through Netflix. And I came across in the dark. Like I saw, so I saw the trailer for it a while ago. So for my foundation, I mix. Like if I'm doing a full face of makeup, I end up mixing the Revlon Candid Glow and just the Revlon Candid. So it's this one and this one. Um, but I mix these two because it matches my skin tone a lot better and it just makes it look like shiny but matted at the same time. So just like a little dewy. Keep in mind, I have no idea what I'm saying. I normally just do my makeup like whatever. I knew what I was saying about um, in the in the dark. So came across it on Netflix. These um these episodes are like forty minutes long each. I got off of work at like what was it like eight thirty and then I was talking to my sister. I ate something and yeah, I was watching Friends and. Um, then I was like, all right, like I'm gonna go to bed or something. And I come into my room, I'm not tired. So I was like, oh, this is great. Luckily today's my day off. So it's not like I need to be wide awake, but um, I'm sorry, I'm trying to focus on both. I can't multitask whatsoever. Um, anyway, so what I was saying, I was watching Friends last night. I go into my room and I couldn't sleep. So I just turned on my TV and I was like, okay, like, I don't want to watch something I've already watched like I'm getting so tired of that because that's normally what I do um and then I was just like I kept like scrolling for like a solid 30 minutes and I was like oh maybe this will make me tired it did not make me tired whatsoever so I came across in the dark and then I let like the trailer play for a little bit and then I was just like hmm this actually looks interesting 
I'd seen the trailer before and I knew like I was interested in it, but I didn't like actually watch any of it. So I put it on. Now I'm like on episode six and I was like, wow, practically spent like five hours of my life just watching. I spent like five hours of my life just watching this. Okay, so I ran out of um, the my eyebrow pencil like forever ago. So now I just go in with either the Morphe palette and I use like obviously the darker shades for my eyebrows or I'll use the, Ul the Ulta Beauty palette and use the brown there in the middle. I'm gonna go with the Ulta Beauty. So I go in with my eyebrows next. I use the color brownie. I think that's what it says, yeah. Use the color brownie right there for my eyebrows. So I started that show and yeah, now I'm five episodes in and I'm invested in this show. It is so funny. The most random thing ever and like, it's interesting. What the show's about is it's about a blind girl. She had this friend, he like helped her out when somebody was trying to mug her. So he helped her out, she, he like saved her life and they became friends that way, right? They're friends for a while and one day she goes like on a walk and she tries to go like, she went to go like talk to him and he wasn't there. She pretty much stumbles across like what looked or felt like a body and she thought it like she thinks it's him so she's just trying to figure out who killed him because she thinks he's dead but everybody else like his family and like like his family and the people that work with him and everything they're like they keep saying that he's alive and it's just a whole mess now i'm gonna do my eyeshadow i've been using this palette apparently not today so i've been using um this color and this color for my lids. It's just so it's not like too dark, but it gives it a pop of color, kind of. So um, I also like it to be a little shiny, just like a little bit, kind of. So I'm gonna go in with the Morphe palette. I go in with a mixture of Glow Girl and Legacy. Right on top of that, just so it gives it a little shine. Moving on. Um, so then I go in and do my eyeliner, which I'm gonna move the camera so y'all can get a better look at it. Kind of, I don't know if there could be like, maybe I could just move in a little closer. With my eyeliner, um, I like to start off with a line right here and then a line right here. So as you can see, it's just a line right there and right there. Um, and then I like to go from the middle and go out and connect the line. So right now it just looks like this. It looks really weird, right? Um, and then from here, I go from the inside of my eye and go to where this ends. So like that. Um, and then after this, I just fill in the empty spots, clearly, so you get your wing liner. So that's my eyeliner. So, um, now I'm just gonna put mascara on my lashes. Um, I use three different mascaras. <laughs> um, so lately I've been using this one, which is one that my grandmother brought back from Mexico. And this one's another one that she brought back from Mexico. And I've also been using the Milk Kush Mascara. This feels amazing, but all three of them combined and are my favorite. My lashes stay really, really well. So boom, first one, done. Then I go in with the Milk Kush Mascara. And then I go in with the purple one. Oh, I forgot to mention that the eyeliner I use is the Maybelline New York eyeliner. And for the bottom lashes, I go back in with the Milk Kush Mascara. Now I'm gonna be putting on my eyelashes. The, these eyelashes that I have right now 
are the I don't have the box anymore which I know sounds terrible so the brand of the lashes that I use are kiss and same with the eyelash glue I just don't remember exactly what the name of the actual lash is but ones that I really really love are these kind of and but my favorite favorite from kiss are the ritzies hello Are you home? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Does in the casa? Yeah. Alright, bye. See you later. Bye. Now I'm going to my mom's house. Okay. So um this is my eyes with my lashes. Um so then I go in with my two face chocolate bronzer. I go from like about here to like right there. I'm going under my chin and then a little more and up here and on my nose so then um for blush i stole this from my sister but i go in with this it's in the shade beam i thought it was bean do it up there and up here and then i do a little bit on the tip of my nose and on the bridge of my nose Just doing a little bit of um, eyeliner on my waterline. And then finally, I go into my highlighter and I use the Anastasia Glow Kit. Um, I would put it up, but I kind of broke that one. So I use uh, the color Marshmallow and with a little bit of butterscotch for the inside of my eye. I use butterscotch. right there in between my eyebrows and then I go back in with butterscotch and starburst just a little bit on the tip of my nose then I use butterscotch and starburst right there and then for my lips I use um, the spice lip pencil put it all over and then um, and then I go in with the Kat Von D Ophelia Liquid Lipstick. This is my everyday makeup look. I'm gonna go get changed and then I'll show you guys my outfit of the day. And I'll head over to my parents' house. My camera died. Um, so I'm gonna use my phone. So this is my outfit. My hair is just in a little ponytail. Um, so I'm gonna go to my parents' house. Good morning guys, um, I've actually been up since 6 in the morning. My sister and I decided to go, actually this was my sister's idea, I'm not going to take credit for it, but um, we bought our parents some coffee and we took it to them. So I've been up since 6 in the morning, we came home, I made myself some breakfast and I washed dishes, cleaned my room a little bit, well made my bed. Now I'm about to get ready. So I'm going to go do my makeup really quick and... I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Okay, so I just got changed. This is my outfit for today. I like it. <laughs> so, just got ready. I'm gonna do like the smallest haul in the world. Uh, I'm really, really excited about this. These came in on Monday. Um, I didn't know about that until yesterday. So I went to grab them after I came back from my parents' house. These are from Dolls Kill. As you guys know, I I watched Bridgerton, and in the middle of watching Bridgerton, I fell. I love the style. Like, so I got two pieces of clothing from Dolls Kill. Um, I got this top. 
It is a puffy sleeve white top. It's kind of got like a flare at the bottom. Um, this is what it looks like. I, I adore it very much. It's very, very cute. Um, but it literally just matches like every other shirt that's in my closet right now. So that was the first one. And for the second top, and this is my favorite. So these are kind of like, these are like little ribbon, little ties for the shoulders. It's so cute. This. This top is definitely very, very Bridgerton. Like, <laughs> I fell in love with it. Um, anyway, so I was watching Bridgerton and then I just started looking for like corset tops even though like, this is my corset top. It is my favorite. I think it's gonna be my favorite piece of clothing that's in my closet. Um, uh, it is like a little, like light blue and the design itself, like, that's what the design looks like. It looks like a royal bedroom or something with like a mirror. It just looks like a vanity, actually. So cute, I can't wait to actually be, like, to actually be able to wear it out. So that's my little haul for today. Since I did do a makeup tutorial, kind of, and a little haul, um, and I don't really have much planned today, I think I'm just gonna end this vlog here so I can enjoy the rest of my day. It's pretty early in the morning, which is crazy because I have my whole day ahead of me. And keep in mind, I have a night job, which normally, since I sleep later at night, I normally wake up at like maybe noon. Earliest, probably like 11 or 10. It is so weird actually being awake since six in the morning today and not like taking a nap or anything. I actually like enjoy it very much. I feel like a normal person. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye.